again i heard of oath you put you stop that nonsense agreement is oath if you and somebody agree that is oath oath is not when you bring out blood oath is not when you bring out blood so you push you stop those things that those insinuations you push you stop it i and the apostle ken has an oath where he we agreed that i'm now a member of his family his brother yes and we agreed that he will never see anything evil and allow it to happen to me but today he has derailed now let me start from what i want to say i want to touch an apostle ken and benelis joyce lovely and uh, others first apostle ken i had wanted to go in detail about apostle ken but i've seen that there is no need the matter will be treated once and for all at the appropriate time god will start his own now human will start their own next time which i don't know but i want to tell you apostle ken you are a wicked man you have no conscience you have no conscience because of the wickedness in your heart you throw stone first i bear everything i bear because of you now let me just tell you every covenant i have with you you have broken them so i stand before the almighty god to tell you that any covenant between me and you i withdraw myself from it i am not having you as a brother at all go your way why i go my way i will never see any evil personally evil personally and allow it to happen to any of any person that is good but anybody that is evil evil must surely happen to him i stand to tell you that you are evil and as long as god leave it evil will happen to you you have seen what you did what you know is how to destroy relationship for your interests you destroy relationship have been waiting to see how you can well i know you can't try it but i'm just asking god if anything will happen and uh, i will be involved again maybe by you or by your cohort in police or in court i would have been happy so much because everything i'm saying i meant it and i won't leave it like that unless god want me to just leave it like that i was saying you are evil you have seen what happened what you did to ellis but that day when we were settling you didn't even act as if you had one that sent him you kept quiet when all these things was happening i told you you were dribbling me just because you are evil somebody that said he has somebody in heart as a brother kai you are a wicked man god knows you are a wicked man and let me tell you remember oh, you are not disbursing any grant you are not disbursing any grant anything you disburse today is not of god maybe of human that human human being like all any other person say come and disburse this it's not god stop that language i don't know if you are forgetting yourself you said it that god told you 2023 that 20 years to come you will disburse a grant and that thing ended 2023 this is 2024 so your turn has gone for that reason you should understand that god rejected esau and uplifted david please stop fighting anything at all that time you said god told you has passed any other one now is no longer god you are forcing yourself or on people or people want you not god oh i didn't say you will not disburse any money oh. if you have money to disburse you disburse but it's no longer god don't include god again that one has passed and that is it after i finish this thing i will pass the judgment because that is why also i am brought to grand community to set records straight so that people will understand that there is still god yes 